Okay, so the boys are in there doing some math problems. They watched a math video dividing by two digits. No, not dividing. Multiplying by two digits. <clears throat> and so that's what they're in there doing now. Some problems. I wrote them on the board. I cleaned off the board. Haven't even used that board in a long time. And I'll show you that in just a second. But right now, Ashlyn has finished her. Move your arm, baby girl. Her color, color yellow worksheet. And in the previous video, I put where I got this worksheet from. And I just traced the worksheet and made my own. So it is not originally mine, but that's what I did. And if you want to see the book that I got that from, it's in the previous video. So here's me checking her worksheet. Her name, Ashlyn, A-S-H-L-Y-N-N. -N. And then... Yellow, the directions are color each picture yellow, then draw the picture of something else, then draw a picture of something else yellow. So, what do we have that's yellow, Ashlyn? I have a crayon that's yellow. You drew a crayon that's yellow? Yeah. Okay, what else did you draw that's yellow? A sun and a flower. And a flower. All oh, those are yellow. That's great, Ashlyn. And what is this right here? That's a lemon. And what color is a lemon? Yellow. What about that? Corn. And what about that? A, a banana. And this wasn't originally on the first worksheet, but I just put this down here because she can always practice writing. And this looks great, Ashlyn. Come here. Let Mommy tell you something. You need to put a space in between your words. Do you know what a space is? What? Like, don't write it right beside there. If this is one word and this is one word, we want it to look like it. Go give me a pencil so I can show you what I'm talking about. We already learned this week to put period behind our sentences. So now we're going to talk about her spacing these words out. Hurry up, Ashlyn. These two items uh, were in her toys, and she said, I have I some corn a and a lemon. Pencil. I okay, give me a pen. Give me anything. Hurry up. A corn <laughs> and a lemon. You, it's too close. Put your hand back. You got to put it, like, right here. There we go. Now we can see it. Corn and a lemon. Is that your stuff? Why'd you get those out? Because you tell me to. I mean, but the first time I told you to get them out so we could do your video. But didn't you go get this out of your toys? No. You did the first time. I said, Ashlyn, what you doing? You said, I'm getting my lemon. You don't remember that? Who got it out of the teapot stuff? Who got that out? Mm -hmm. Did I get that out of your teapot stuff? Mm -hmm. Who got it out? Me. Okay, so why did you get it out? Because you tell me to get it out. Okay, never mind. I'm talking about the first time. That's okay. Are you going to go give me a pen so I can tell you about spacing? Okay. Thank you. No, she got it out the first time. She was like, I got a, a lemon and a corn. And then I just told her to go get it out so we could check her work. But yeah. Um, on the original worksheet, there was a little box at the bottom. It said, uh, for extra work or whatever. I'll go get it in a minute. But it said for additional work with this worksheet, find items around the house that are yellow. Ashlyn! I need a pencil or a pen. And then after this, we're going to read the second story in this one. I accidentally, this is the Bear Family All in the Family. It has a lot of little short stories, which when you're reading them, it takes forever. Them Berenstein Bears, they be having some words in their books. But um, we read the Berenstein Bears and the Week at Grandma's. We read that yesterday and we read it another day. And then today we're going to read the Berenstain Bears and the Trouble with Grown Ups.
Okay, I'll take this pen right here. And so on and so on and so on. And I tell mom that I I tell the son that they couldn't work, but they can't work. I tell him. Okay, thank you, ma'am. Okay, so here we go. When I'm talking about spacing, Ashlyn, is this one yellow or two yellow words? Two yellow words. That is two yellow words. So one yellow word looks like this. Watch mommy. Hold on. That? Hold on. This is one yellow, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, so now we need to leave a space right there and then start the second one over here. So it looks like two words instead of one word. So when we do this tomorrow, make sure if you're writing the word two times, leave some room in between there because it looks like one long word, but it's two. So we want to leave the space in between there. Look up here at these words right here. You see that's one word, then it's a space, and then the new one starts, and then space. Do you understand what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Try that for me with this pen right here. You could do it right under mommy's. Oh, you know, yellow. You could do yellow. You can do it under mommy's. And yes, I do see that. Is that one word, yellow? Yeah. And then... Space. space. Very good. And then. There. And there. There. And there. And what word is that again? Yellow. And how do you spell yellow? Um. Y E L what did you You just said it. L Uh huh, you have one in your name. How can you forget? Go ahead. L L O W. Oh, that's I mean, awesome. You did it. That's awesome. That's a W. It is? <laughs> yes, it is. Okay. Now we're going to read this book. Mom, I want to watch the movie one. I'm sure you do when I watch that movie one. Y'all, I'm going to turn this way because it was on my floor. is ridiculous. Okay, so this is what What's up, they're supposed to be doing. Are you guys done? No. It was just 11. That's it. Like, that should take like 11 seconds. 11 seconds? Just pause. Let's finish this, baby.